equations of motion for modal body systems. Deformation representation of a modal flexible body. Suppose we have a modal flexible body in a plane. A nodal position of a modal body in the global frame can be obtained by adding the original position vector and deformation vector u prime as follows. Please pay attention to that deformation u prime is expressed in the body reference frame. Therefore, a nodal position of a modal body can be located as in this equation. Deformation u prime is represented by linear combination of mode shapes as follows. We call the coefficient of the mode shape modal coordinates. As an example, a deformation shape can be represented in a pictorial form by linear combination of mode shapes as follows. Component mode synthesis. ANSYS motion adopts component mode synthesis method proposed by Craig Bampton. The first candidate mode are the eigenvectors of the modal body obtained after imposing fixed boundary conditions. The second candidate mode are the static solutions after imposing unit displacements on the boundary degrees of freedom one by one. These candidate modes are not orthogonal. In order to obtain orthogonal mode, Generalized mass and stiffness matrices are calculated by projecting these matrices into the mode shape as follows. Also normalization of mode shapes. If we obtain the eigenvectors of the generalized stiffness and mass matrices, they are naturally orthogonal. Therefore, the final mode shape used in the solver are obtained by calculating the eigenvectors of the generalized mass and stiffness matrices. Since the rigid body mode of a modal body is covered by the body reference frame of the modal body, the rigid body mode must be removed from the eigenvectors if there are any. Equations of motion for a modal body. Nodal position, velocity, and acceleration of a modal body can be obtained as follows. The virtual work theorem can be used to derive the equations of motion for a modal body. The virtual works done by inertial force, external force, and strain energy are as follows. Substituting the virtual nodal displacement and acceleration and strain energy into the virtual work equation is the following equations of motion for a modal body. Modal equation of motion. The mass matrix and stiffness matrix are obtained as in this equation. It is important to note that eight invariants are calculated once and saved to avoid the recalculation associated with the two loops of all flexible body nodes. Modal body example. Let us consider a two-body system. The system consists of one rigid body and one modal flexible body. Rigid body is connected to the ground by a translational joint. The modal body is connected to the first body by a revolute joint. Since the origin of the body reference frame of the modal body is located at the center of the revolute joint, the constraints for the revolute joint are obtained as follows. Constraint and Jacobian matrix. The joint constraint and their Jacobian matrix are obtained as follows. Generalized spring force. Generalized force for the spring is obtained as follows. Assumed mode shapes. The mode shape are assumed to make it easy to present the equation of motion for this example. Equation of motion can be obtained by applying the general form of equations of motion for a modal body which was presented earlier. The invariant are calculated as follows. Mass matrix for modal body. The mass matrix is obtained as follows.
augmented equation of motion. Finally, the augmented equation of motion for this example are obtained as follows.